Okay. <laughs> um, hi, my name is Katerina Macario. I'm 21 years old. My name is Mia Fischel. I'm 19 years old. Uh, I'm Naomi Gurma. I'm 20 years old. i um, from San Jose, California, and this is my first national team camp. My first camp's going well. Um, it's really exciting to be here in this environment and meet all of the players and get to just see how they play and be able to uh, play alongside them. Just getting to know the, the women on this team is amazing and watching them play, it's just, I know I'm improving my game every day I'm here. I'm just so thankful for this opportunity to be here and to be learning from them. It was a relief, like, seeing them on the roster. I'm like, okay, like, at least I have, you know, Ashley Sanchez if I need her and uh, Naomi Gurma also a great friend from U20s. It's so special to have like old U20 teammates, U17 teammates, Stanford teammates here. I think it just makes me feel more comfortable and helps me integrate with the team more. And it's always great to have familiar faces by my side. There were a little nerves, but I was more excited than nervous for sure. Getting to play in the back line next to Crystal Dunn and Abby Dahlkamper, I was like, Wow, this is crazy. <laughs> the first 5v2 that I was put in, I was with Ali and Becky, and Ali was really just going at me and being like, come on, like, first pass. And I was just like very nervous to, I guess, just not mess up. And so eventually I got the, the hang of it, and I think I made her proud. I don't know, I made myself proud, so. <laughs> Being with the full team just has that higher intensity. The biggest adjustment has definitely been the speed of play. It just requires a certain type of maturity to be here and to be able to play and learn from these players and be confident in yourself that you also have something to bring to the table. Going into all the environments before, I started off as a newbie and I feel like that's when I learned the most and where I developed the most. So yeah, it's just great uh, taking direction from the older players and just having them guide me. Silver lining of quarantine on the soccer side was just getting to focus on the finer skills and just develop things that I don't usually uh, pay as much attention to. And then on the personal side, I've been cooking a little more. <laughs> um, I also took more time um, to learn how to braid, which you can see. <laughs> I did do the toilet paper challenge. <laughs> I definitely did use my brother a lot because he also plays soccer, so I definitely was my training partner when I was going out and his physicality and his plays is sharp, so it was nice to use him as uh, my defender. I know that, you know, with over a million deaths in, in the world and 200,000 plus cases here that, you know, there are far bigger things that we need to worry about. And so to have had my season postponed almost just became irrelevant and so I just am really just taking this time to focus on myself and to learn new things. I guess just redesign who I am and who I want to be on the field.